fundamental analysis is an important part of trading. And I'm going to give you a maxim here. The longer you plan on being in a trade, the more important the fundamentals become. Now, a day trader may or may not care about fundamentals because they're only really planning on being in a trade for one day. An investor, on the other hand, would only want to invest in fundamentally strong companies that have potential for growth, companies that pay dividends, um, that are well run. And again, you know, when you when you get a look at their books, you see that they have income and earnings and low debt and uh, you know good return on equity and the price of the stock compared to the return. Um, to the the price of the stock compared to the earnings and things are metrics that uh, fundamental analysts take very seriously. Now, as a swing trader, if you're only planning on being in a trade for a couple of weeks, the fundamentals are important. We certainly don't ignore them. We always want them on our side. Um, and if you're a position trader, they become even more important. And again, if you're an investor, they're vitally important. So the longer you plan on being in the trade, the more important those fundamentals become. Now, learning fundamental analysis can take a little bit of time. You can read books on the topic, of course, and watch videos and things and learn how to read the fundamental data. Here I'm looking at the fundamental price chart of one of the stocks I've been using as example here on um, BSX, and it's in the healthcare sector, and we can get down, go down and get a look at it, and you can go visit the company's website, and you can see all of those information and things they offer on the website for investor relations. And you can come out here and you can look at the earnings, and you can see what the earnings per share are, $1.24 per share, and you can check out and you can read the numbers, like what's their return on equity, and you can look at it as, you know, what, what's their growth, you know, their gross profit margin, and, and uh, you can look at a whole bunch of little metrics like you know total asset turnover and inventory turnover you know, how fast is are their products you know coming in and going out and uh, you can look at again you know their debt and you can see a lot of the numbers you can compare the price of the stock to the earnings and and uh, book value and just all kinds of fundamental metrics and again the longer you plan on being in a trade the longer the more important uh, those fundamentals become and again, if you're, you know, in your IRA and your retirement accounts, you have those long-term investments. Of course, you want to pick those fundamentally strong juggernauts and do really good analysis on those. And then for your swing trades, again, in your day trades, it's not as critical, but we always want them on our side. And so technical traders use fundamentals and they trade with the trends, of course, to improve their odds.